Hello guys, this is my Svotor FPS guide for PC. We're starting with right click on the desktop and choose Cataclysm Control Center. And after that we are going into Gaming, 3D Application Settings. Here you can see my settings I have. Anti-aliasing, use application settings, filtering, 16x, people are saying they get better performance with that, or you can try 2x, and uh, texture filtering quality, we will set to performance because we want performance in game of course, wait for vertical refresh, performance 2, and uh, anti-aliasing mode performance. And we're done in here. Go down to the right corner, right click on the contact list, choose your desktop, and choose optimal performance. Of course, we want performance. And again, choose desktop, green settings, and we should focus on filtering here like we did before, and we want 16x there too. And if you get lags, you can try 2x too, because some people running better with 2x and some people 16x. I think it's a GPU thing. And now we are going to navigate to our Swooter map, users. Then pick your user and uh, app data folder. You can only see this folder if you have uh, unhidden the hidden maps in your settings. Pick local, pick Swooter map, pick Swooter again, and settings, and click client settings. Open this with Notepad or uh, I had notepad plus plus or something. Here you can see my settings I have, and the set you should not focus on is the height, native height, native width, refresh rate. These are my settings for my monitor. The rest of the settings you can focus on and change. So you can run the game smoothly. Yeah, I'm going to post these settings below, so you can copy and write it in. And uh, then if, when you're done, you can save it and close it. And go to Graphics Mirror. And the set settings you should focus on here is the Vertical Sync, and put false there. And the Bloom effect, put false there too. And the Ground Cluttering des Density, zero. Spread three distance zero and save and close and we are done here too and this part is for more advanced users check your cpu speed i recommend you to run at least four gigahertz on your core clock because uh, the hero engine is only a thing single threaded application that's the engine swooter is running on so if you have 2.5 gigahertz or 3 gigahertz your low sync performance and your RAM should be at least 6 gigab gigabytes, I think, because I'm uh, having problem with 4 gigabytes of RAM. Uh, yeah, I'm getting like uh, 20 to 30 more FS with 4 GHz than 3 GHz. And I'm out.